One of the key things that I've been explaining to people is when you do a sales storyline or a sales presentation or anything in live actually, you always have a peak of attention in the beginning and at the end, and that's still very valid. And I always thought that whatever sales story I make, I gotta focus on the beginning and the end. Now, I saw um, over the weekend, I saw a documentary with a cognitive psychologist and he actually said, that's not entirely true. He said what well, people remember, and he did lots of studies, so the man is right, he said, they remember the end, which is part, but they also remember the best part, where the emotion kicks in, and we all know emotion, but it's not the emotion, it's the best part. So the more I've been thinking about it, the more I think that the question is, what is the best? And I still believe it's probably sitting in the beginning because people give you full attention for the first three to four minutes, and then you talk about them, you talk about the problem. And actually for them, that's probably the best part because it's still them. And they'll go like, this person understands me. That's exactly what my problem is. And they'll pay a lot of attention. So remember, it is not only the beginning, it's actually the best part. So even if you move it a bit later on in your presentation by doing, typically what I would do is adding contrast. I would have slides and then I would have a black slide that says stop. Or I would say, this is how you can do it. They all go like that and say, I'm sorry, it's not going to work, my friends. Something like that adds contrast, people will remember. So remember the best in the end.